This video is to help with common questions and issues regarding Step 2 of the Select Room part of Contract Renewal. The Contract Renewal process has two steps. Step 1 is where you renew your contract and pay the prepayment, and if applicable, opt to stay in your same room. Step 2 is where you can select a room. Beginning at the start of your group's scheduled time, you can select a room based on what is available across campus. You will only see rooms you are eligible to select. If you are already assigned because you selected to stay in your same room, you can still select a new room. Tip number one. If no rooms are displayed for a particular hall, either there is no space available or you are not eligible to live in that hall. This can occur if the building is reserved for a specific learning community. You must be enrolled in that specific major or college to select a room. Please review the Contract Renewal Guide and the Resident Services website for more information on which buildings are reserved for learning communities. This can also occur if you are including a roommate request, and even if you are eligible for the learning community, your roommate request may not be. For example, if I'm in the College of Arts and Sciences, but my roommate request is not, and I select him or her in this process, I will not see any space available in the College of Arts and Sciences learning community. This is because my roommate request does not meet the eligibility for that building. Please note that some of our buildings are restricted by age or credit hour. If you do not meet the age or credit hour requirement, you will not see any available spaces. The same is true for your roommate request. Tip number two. Selecting a room with a roommate request only works once. When you select to include your unassigned roommate request, you are able to assign them with yourself only one time. After this one time, your requested roommate must manually change rooms alongside with you should both of you wish to live in another room. Tip number three. If no include roommate option appears, confirm that your friend requested you and that your request does not already have an assignment. For the roommate request function to work, the roommate request must be mutual and the potential roommate must not already have an assignment for fall. Tip number four. If your roommate request is confirmed, but he or she has not completed or submitted their application, you will not see any available rooms in any hall if you have them checked to include. To resolve this, either uncheck your roommate request and assign just yourself, or confirm with your roommate request that the request is mutual and that they do not already have an assignment for fall. If you have any further questions, please contact our offices at 330-672 7021 or by email at housing at kent.edu.